my god you know what today is today's a day where i find out if i made it inside my dream school for a week this is so important to me that look i am not going to be brushing my teeth today i need to run downstairs and check my mail oh my god my heart is pounding so fast oh no guys my mailbox is closed that means that there definitely should be a letter inside we have to go and check it let's open it up over here i see a letter oh no oh no breathe angel breathe it just it's something not big no it is pretty big it's a big deal for me okay here we have it let's go inside and see the moment of truth inside this letter it would tell me if i have made it inside the creative arts school the most expensive school in brookhaven and today i'll find out if i will go there for a whole week this is for a scholarship program let's open it up oh my god guys i'm feeling so dizzy this is how important it is wait 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 wait, wait. before i faint on the ground let me just take a sip of this and now let's go and open this angel you have scored 99 percent you have been given one week free entry to creative art school oh my god i cannot believe i made it oh my god dad i made it did you get in angel uh no i didn't oh it's okay <laughs> guys they don't know psych i did it dad i made it inside the creative school no way yes way yes it finally paid off my hard work paid off i get to go inside my dream creative school for a whole week i'm so excited to drop you off to your creative art school i'm so happy dad i just want to dance and dance and that's all i want to do <gasps> rosie i need to go rosie and see if she made it in as well okay dad i'll be back oh no i really hope rosie Rosie made it in as well. Let's get our phone over here. Let's dial her up. Ding, 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 ding. And whew. guys, I really hope she made it. Angel, before you ask me, I didn't make it in. Oh, no. No. Aw. It's okay, Rosie. I mean, you have next year because you can apply again. Oh, my God. That means I won't have anyone to sit next to in school for one week. But you already know, like, I'm not really that creative. It makes sense. Wait, did you get in? Yes, I made it in. I'm so happy. No way. Oh, my God. That's such great news. Thanks, but I'm so sad you didn't make it in. But it's okay. Okay, we can do it again next year. That's fine. That's fine. I've heard that many rich people go to that school. I know. I'm super nervous and scared, but so excited. You should probably start packing. I'm not going to waste your time. Bye. Bye, girl. Oh, man, I'm so upset and Rosie didn't make it in, but it's only for a week. I'll just see how it goes and I can tell her everything about it. Guys, one thing you didn't know about me is that I love creativity. I love drawing. I love painting. I like imagining new ideas. I I like bringing my imagination into real life. I love making YouTube videos. I love recording. I love editing. I still cannot believe I made it. Uh, uh, who's that? Who's honking outside? Dad, what's up? Hurry up, Angel. We don't have all day. All right. I need to go get ready. Oh, my God. I didn't even get time to brush my teeth. Uh, let's just quickly sit down. Brush, brush, brush. Ow, 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 ow. That hurts. That hurts. I should have brushed my hair yesterday. And now we have to go and pick an outfit. Guys, guys, this creative school, it's no joke, okay? People take the fashion super serious. So I need to look a bit presentable. And clearly, most of the days, I'm walking around my PJs. Now we have to step up our game. Let's see. Uh we go for this um what should i wear i need to look extra good so i gotta put a lot of time and effort into it dad i will be ready just give me two minutes um i need to hurry up okay guys wait 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 i know what to wear i purchased this outfit like last year but i've never worn it before maybe we should give this a go <gasps> perfect i look so good okay dad i'm coming wait one last thing we gotta smell good let me and we are good to go i cannot believe i'm about to enter the school of my dreams for one whole week i'm ready dad let's go uh god dad i told you you need to buy yourself a new car this is so slow how are we gonna reach there on time i'm trying fast angel be patient 
Oh man, this is going to take one whole year. Are we there yet, Dad? Oh man, this is going to be one long trip. Oh no, Dad, get, Dad, go! It's going to be red light. Oh man. Oh wow. <gasps> Dad, look at all these expensive cars. They are so expensive. I don't even know what they are called. I know this is a pink Lamborghini, and and. <gasps> Oh my god, I cannot believe I made it to my dream school! Oh my god, dad, dad, be careful! Oh no, this is so embarrassing, my dad's car is still making a squeaky sound! Dad, you didn't park properly! These girls are watching me! Wow, I can't believe you have grown so big now! <laughs> dad, you need to park properly! I hope you have an amazing week! Okay, thanks, dad, you can just drop me off here! Bye, dad! I'll see you soon! Oh no! Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Our car is so broken. Anyways, let's go. As soon as I came inside, I knew immediately that those two rich girls were judging me so bad. Was that a toy car you got dropped in? Uh, no. This is what you call a car. Oh, well, I don't really care as long as I have a vehicle to take me somewhere. These are the most richest, wealthiest, and popular girls in this creative school. This is Sasha and this is our best friend Natasha. They own all the expensive cars and they do not like poor people. Let's just say that my first few minutes in this rich school wasn't what I thought it would be. The first thing I saw was the mean girls. They weren't just any ordinary girls. They were rich, spoiled mean girls. They came to this art school in Lambos, Ferraris, Bugattis, you name it. I mean, take a look at these cars. The first thing they did when they stepped outside the cars is rush to the bathroom to apply, you guess it, makeup. But wow, they all look so beautiful and stylish. They went outside to the lockers and that's when they start their daily dose of gossiping. Yeah, they can do this for many hours. Oh my god, did you see what that new girl was wearing? She looked so yeah. bad. Yeah, <laughs> Ew, totally couldn't be me. Then it doesn't stop there, you guys. We have the rich boys. Yeah, and guess who I saw? Charles Ritchie. Let me tell you something about him. He's the richest, most popular boy in my school. He somehow ended up in this one-week program as well. Hmm, I wonder how. He has failed every exam. Probably his daddy's money. Ugh. Some people really need to work their way up for this. The rich boys came in expensive sports cars. I mean, it makes sense. It's literally the most expensive art school in the city. The boys went straight to the basketball court. Typical. And me being the unlucky girl I am, I was walking past them when suddenly... Oh, sorry. My bad. Didn't mean to do that. A ball hit me right in my head. Ouch. Hey, are you okay? And there's me. Yep, the most embarrassing moment ever. And, you know, I can't control my emotions, so I had to burst it all out. Oh my god, you guys, it was so embarrassing. I had to rush to the cafeteria. And you know what made it even worse? They were staring at me. I caught them watching me. And I'm pretty sure they were also talking about me. There she is. By the looks of it, it didn't seem like they were saying good stuff. After lunch, it was art class. And guys, when I looked inside, it was like hell. All the popular and rich kids stopped and stared right at me. They were looking deep inside of me. It was so creepy. I decided to ignore it and focus on my art class because I have an art competition starting up soon and I need to win. But you guys, while in the process of doing my art, I could swear I saw Charles secretly watching me from the corner of my eyes. I mean, look at yourself. See? He slowly spun around and look, look, he's looking right at me. Hmm, I wonder what he's thinking about me. And obviously the public kids were talking and laughing about me. Ugh, they have nothing better to do with their life. Anyways, I really hope I win this art competition. Now it's time for the next day. The next day when I arrived at school, I told my dad to drop me off a few minutes away from school 
maybe at the back of the school I don't know as long as the bullies could not see me and the squeaky car I just felt like it was much easier for me to take the hard way by walking to school instead of the bullies making fun of my dad's special squeaky car I love my dad and I love my car but I do not tolerate the bullies making fun of it so I just decided to tell my dad to drop me off a bit far away from school so the bullies don't see it are you sure you want to get dropped here dear and I do with my dad finding out and getting upset when he sees the bullies making fun of me. I waved my dad goodbye and then it just struck me that I am going to be having to deal with these bullies for one whole week. Sometimes it just feels really good to get all your emotions out. Anyways, I just decided to toughen up and head back inside school. At this point, I was soaking wet. I entered school thinking I would have a good day and no one would annoy me. But guess who was wrong? Me. I went to them thinking they wanted to become friends with me. But wow, what they said next really shocked me. <laughs> they were laughing and pointing and mimicking me and calling me all these names that I don't even want to say. Gross. How did you even get inside this art school? You look so childish with that koala hat girl. It's grossing me out. You really do not fit in with this popular rich girls group. At that point, I really couldn't control my emotions. I started crying and crying and ran straight to the bathrooms. Because that is my comfort place. I dashed inside the toilet and I was about to take my koala hat off. And for a second, I really just wanted to flush it down. But then I stopped. This koala hat has been with me since forever. Am I really going to get rid of it because some mean girls made fun of it? No. After an hour later, I built the courage to go outside and have my lunch because I didn't want anyone looking out for me. And guess who were sitting in front of me? The mean girls. <laughs> Loner. She looks like a baby's diaper. <laughs> Loner! And again, they never had anything good to say. Oh, and that's when Charles decided to show up. It was super strange and awkward. Um... Hey, uh, I was just checking to see if you were okay. I mean, I could have been having a good day if these girls weren't so rude to me. But it's okay, whatever. What is Charles doing there? Ugh. I know, right? Ugh. I mean, I think you shouldn't really care about them. Well, I mean, I've reached a stage where I really don't care. At first, it was kind of annoying. It was really impacting me, but it's whatever, I guess. They are just super jealous girls. Yeah, they are super jealous of your koala hat. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, why did you decide to sit next to me out of nowhere? By the way, your prom posters look amazing in the school hall. Wait, really? My prom posters got selected? But I really thought I was bad at art. I didn't think I would pass. Oh my god, I have to go check this out for myself. No way. I cannot believe the art design that I did in my art class has been approved. Oh my god. It is there. Yeah, amazing, right? I guess so. I mean, it should be amazing for it to be selected. So, are you going to prom tonight? Oh, prom. I kind of forgot about it. Um, Probably not. Uh, I mean, it's best if I don't go. I can't stand these mean girls. They are probably going to make fun of my dress because they are probably going to be wearing like $10,000 worth of dresses. I mean, uh, I don't really have anyone to go to prom with. Do you want to go with me? Just, you know, like a friend thing? Oh my god. Is that the most popular, the most richest, the most coolest guy in school asking me out to prom? No, 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 guys. What do I say? Do I say yes or do I say no? I mean, this is once in a lifetime opportunity. If I go to prom, all the girls will finally get a taste of their own medicine. They will get super, super jealous. What do I say? What do I say? Uh, I'm not really sure. I mean, it's up to you, but I think it would be fun. Hmm, fun, you say? It certainly won't be fun with me, but it would certainly be fun when I see the look on my bully faces when they see I go to prom with Charles Ritchie. 
So, I mean, has he been giving a dare? Why would he want to go with me out of all these pretty girls in the school? Out of all them popular girls at school, he wants to go to prom with me. I am new. I don't have friends. And, and I don't look as good and as presentable as the other girls. Uh, what do I say? What do I say? Uh, I need some time to think, Charles. I will let you know by the end of this day. Uh, I will see you then. Oh my god, I cannot believe this. You know what I have to do? I have to go and call Rosie immediately. Rosie, I need your help ASAP. I need you to come to the cafe real quick. Rosie will be the one to help me out with this decision. Oh my god, Rosie. There is so much I have to tell you. Okay, so basically... Oh my god, are you serious? You called me for that? Is that even a question? Of course you should go. Wait, really? Yes, you're only in the school for one week, so might as well experience all the luxuries. What's the worst that could happen? A few mean girls laughing at you, so what? And plus, they're gonna get super mad when they see Charles Richie with you. I mean, I guess you are right. I was thinking the same. But Rosie, the prom is literally an hour away. How am I meant to get ready? An hour away? That's it, girl. Even if it was 30 minutes away, I would still managed to get you ready on time let's go what are we waiting for all right after you guys i don't know about this but i'm not having really good feelings about going to a prom with a popular rich boy that certainly doesn't have feelings for me i mean after all why would he want to pick me out of all the girls something is not right uh, i guess i'm just overthinking this what's the worst that could happen rosie is right she always tells me i'm an overthinker let's just go and have fun Angel, hurry up. You're taking forever. <gasps> Rosie, I think this dress is the one. It's so good. Okay, hurry up. You only have like, what, 30 minutes left? Okay, okay, let's go, let's go. Ah, Rosie, I'm so excited to try this on. I wish you were coming with me, though. It's fine, no worries. You can tell me all the girls later. And plus, at least one of us made it. Thanks, Rosie. I don't know what I would have done without you. Okay, I think I should probably get going now and put this dress on and, you know, put all my accessories on. Okay, girl, take care. Okay, bye. Love you, and I'll make sure to keep you informed. Let's go and put all this on. <gasps> Oh my god, wow, you guys. I look so good. Rosie did such a good job at picking this dress out for me. <gasps> guys, I think, I think it's time I go. I'm already running so late. Oh man, I'm already so nervous. Let's go. Wait, uh, is that Charles? Charles, what are you doing here? How do you know where I live? <gasps> oh my god, he looks so good. No, no, no. Oh, is this Charles? It's Charles, the mean, popular guy. There's nothing good about him. We're simply just going to prom just to make these girls feel jealous hey oh wow you look um what should i say you look absolutely gorgeous okay well uh should we go what are we waiting for let's go okay oh an angel i knew you would show up yeah i guess you read me very well oh and yeah uh flowers are for you oh thanks i guess let's go now that wasn't really needed you first Okay, guys, why is Charles acting this nice to me? This is not normal. Anyways, here we go. Oh my god, Charles, slow down. You are driving so fast. Okay, well, here we are. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. It's so loud and packed. Let's go. <gasps> wow, so many pretty dresses. Guys, I cannot believe this. I'm still in a state of shock. First, I made it inside my dream art school for one week. And now I'm going to prom with a spoiled rich popular guy. Wow, my life is so strange. Everything is just so new to me. Anyways, let's go and dance the night away. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I didn't know you were so good at dancing. Well, I mean, usually in my bed at 3 a.m., I do have the weird urge to dance randomly. <laughs> oh, uh, I need to go and use the bathroom. I'll be back. Guys, I need to go and find the washroom so I can quickly call Rosie and tell her how my day is going. But where is the washroom? Uh, is it probably outside? Oh, wow, this outside is so beautiful. Rosie was right. Good thing I went. Anyways, we have to go and call Rosie now. Uh, where is my phone? It should... Oh, uh, Charles, what are you doing here? Are you okay? Hey, is everything fine? Yes, I needed to use a washroom and I kind of got lost and somehow I ended up here. And did you follow me? Uh, may I dance with you, Angel? What? 
Uh, uh, um, guys, what? Why is he asking me that? Here, take my hand. I will show you the steps. Uh, no, it's okay. No, oh, uh, oh, uh, well, this is kind of awkward. Silly girl, she doesn't know I gave Charles Richie a dare. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna let them have their moment. She's gonna be so heartbroken. <laughs>